I'm just going to tell you a little story, and um, I think that really summarizes who and what Elena is. Um, <clears throat> Elena started nursing at Bellevue in New York City in the emergency room. And uh, one day, a uh, disheveled woman came in. She was either pushed or fell down the subway steps. And the head nurse uh, said that uh, she wasn't going to triage this lady. And Elena saw that on the lady's wrist, she had the numbers from the concentration camp. So she went to the head nurse and she said, how can we let this poor soul go when she survived the Nazi concentration camp? So the nurse uh, said, well, I'm not gonna do it. So she went to the head administrator and fought for this woman and they triaged her. About five years later, my husband had, they thought, a heart attack at the Beekman Downtown Hospital in Brooklyn, as opposed to Manhattan, where we were. And they were going to uh, do a, put a swan in, which they go through the carotid artery, and if you're not really great at it, someone could have a heart attack when they do it. And this doctor came in and he said, it's six o'clock, he said, my shift is finished. He said, but I'm going to tell you, I'm going to stay because you're having this procedure done at 11 o'clock tonight. And we sort of looked at him and he said, I'm going to tell you why. He said, I'm the best one here who does this procedure. And the reason I'm doing it, and he looked at Elena and he said, you fought for someone when I was a resident in Bellevue and you saved her life. He said, now I'm going to save your father's life. So, I mean, that's Elena. Elena will fight for the underdog and, and she is such a giving, caring person. And I think she's so well deserving of this.